Hey everybody, NBC5 weather forecaster Brigham Harris here to talk a little bit about the weather we've got coming this week. We do have some colder temperatures coming our way, but it, remember it is going to get warmer as we get closer to the weekend. Right now we do have some cloud cover over our area, but that's not too bad because the visibility actually is doing quite well. Uh, that is subject to changes. We may have some uh, relative humidity bringing fog into the area in the coming days, but for the most part we got a big low pressure system out over the Pacific Ocean, bringing us a little bit colder temperatures here in the next uh, few days, but again that is going to warm up as as we get closer to the weekend. But we do need to talk about a winter weather advisory in the northern part of California down here uh, in mostly Siskiyou County as well as in Del Norte County and some other northern California counties. We do have some snowfall coming our way, especially near Mount Shasta. Could expect a foot or two uh, in those very high elevations. We'll talk uh, more about that in just a second. Our pinpoint forecast does show us that the east of the Cascades is going to be seeing this front before anyone else really. They're going to be seeing a good amount of snowfall into today. The coast should get some rainfall right around then but as we move forward you'll actually see a good amount of snowfall actually will collect along the coast those higher elevations of uh, 1500 to 2500 feet could be seeing some snowfall regardless of where you are but as you can see that blue stays pretty consistent down there in northern california as for the uh, winter weather advisory that's the reason for that and then after it just gets really patchy we can see these chances of snow showers east of the cascades and the uh, snow level will vary from around 2500 feet to around 1,500 feet, again, depending on where you are. We'll talk again more about that in just a little bit. Rainfall forecast shows us that, again, it's east of the Cascades that's gonna see it first, but it's the coast that's gonna see it the most. And you can see down there in Mount Shasta, that's mainly their precipitation count. So let's look at what that means in terms of snowfall. You can see Mount Shasta getting that white color, meaning they're gonna be hit the heaviest with the snowfall. But along the coast there, you can see in those higher elevations near Brookings and such, uh, they will also be getting a good amount of snowfall as well. Tonight and uh, today and tonight, I should say, for the coast, these are your temperatures looking pretty good, right around 40 degrees for the nighttime tonight and the uh, mid, or excuse me, the low 50s to high 40s during the day today. So it is definitely a little bit chillier than it has been the past few days. We are going to see a little bit colder day today. As for west of the valleys, kind of the same thing. Only a couple places getting below freezing temperatures, though, namely northern California, which is, again, due to that winter weather advisory, could definitely cause for some snowfall uh, where we may not enjoy it. Now, east of the Cascades, kind of the same thing. Freezing temperatures uh, east of the Cascades there, especially in Paisley, 25 degrees, Christmas Valley, 22, Crater Lake, as usual still very very cold uh, today will not be a very warm day out there seven day forecast for the rogue valley shows us that we got pretty good temperatures again pretty cold though until we get into the weekend you can see that 58 degrees on saturday and then 53 on sunday so it is definitely going to warm up as we get closer to this weekend same thing for the klamath basin the first part of the week starts out with chances of snow and rainfall temperatures below freezing but it does again start to ramp up a little bit warmth wise when we get closer to the weekend as for northern california same thing again that winter weather advisory is in effect for today and tomorrow until very early Wednesday morning um, so definitely do be careful when out on the roads that could cause for some uh, adverse driving conditions when it comes to visibil visibility snowfall things like that and as for the coast you can see good amount of uh, chance for some thunderstorms today and tomorrow if you get a chance to get some cool shots of the thunder please send those in or the lightning I should say please send those in we love to see those thanks again for tuning in for uh, weekend or excuse me the weekday weather on NBC 5.